local Filipino community group has initiated a food distribution program for those who are stranded in Macau due to coronavirus crisis. In addition to giving out goods such as rice and milk, the group is also distributing free face masks. With hundreds of Filipinos estimated to be stranded in Macau due to the coronavirus travel ban, local groups have taken matters with their own hands. The Filipino Community Alliance in Macau, or PhilCam, has initiated a program distributing free face masks to fellow countrymen affected by the entrance restrictions imposed by the Philippine government to those coming from Macau, Hong Kong and mainland China. The group, with the help of 30 other affiliated organizations, has since expanded its efforts to include giving out meals and groceries. As much as 165 care packs were given out yesterday, which contained goods such as rice, noodles and diapers and milk for children. And tonight, the group continued their efforts, anticipating to help dozens more. Our purpose is uh, to help them ease, you know, the burden of, uh, because some, some of the complaints is they don't have money to buy food and uh, they have hard time buying items because some groceries, uh, some grocery stalls, uh, some of the food is no longer in the shelves. So we're trying to ease their burden by helping, helping them, giving them the basic needs, of especially the food, no? Portuguese adds that although tourists who are stranded are the program's main target, they also welcome local Filipino workers whose jobs are on the line because of the crisis. They are actually the priority, but because there are also OFWs who are being uh, forced leave, and of course they don't have money to uh, spend, so we are also helping them as well. If, if we have that much, of course we will have more. She pointed out that other businesses such as Roadhouse Macau and Filipino staff from the Venetian and Parisian have contributed to the food drive. PhilCam, which is a non-governmental organization, will continue its relief efforts in the coming days and is welcoming donations in all forms.